Okay, here's the final part of tuning up the transmitter on the Swan 700. It's been running here for a while and I have a generator hooked up to it. That's an audio generator. It's on 1500 hertz. And that's going into the microphone jack. Jacked on there. Microphone gain is right now all the way down. So we got a 1500 hertz tone going in there. They're saying tune up the 20 meter band, you know, a dummy load. I'm using my antenna. Balance out the carrier and PA for 50 milliampere. So if we go to tune mode here, or transmit mode, I'm sorry, there's 50 milliampere. So that's correct. The carrier balance, we're going to balance it out for no watts. Or really, no meter reading. Okay, so anyway. There is no watts, zero watts right there. Okay, next step. We got 1500 cycles going in. Adjust the gain of the audio generator and the mic gain to get 10 to 15 watts. I'm gonna go for 15 watts. Back here to transmit. Take up the mic gain to 15 watts. We got audio going in. I got the receiver on too, monitoring the audio. Up oh, 15 watts. What do we got there? 25 watts, that's too much. Let's go down a bit. 15 watts. Right about there. Okay, we're gonna hit the uh, balance modulator. Both slugs. The biggest problem I have is finding my tuning tool because I keep dropping it or losing it or putting it away somewhere. So much for a concise demo. Tuning tool is lost. At any rate, oh, there it is. Ha, ah, it's still in there. So we're in the balance modulator here. That's where to find it on the bottom. Tune that for max watts. It's kind of broad. There you go on the bottom. Tune the top for max. And there you go. Hit the bottom again if I can find it. We're not, there it is. All right, that's perfect. Now, next step is the IF CAN L801. I've marked that thing down there, L801, because why not? Tune this for max. This affects the receiver too, so. There it's maxed, but I hope the receiver's maxed. Seemed like it was a bit off. So for the hell of it, if we go to receive mode here and listen to the background noise, how different does this make it? Oh, it's good. Doesn't affect it much. So, that's fine. Let's continue on and tune that the way they say. That thing was way off for me. Max it up. There it is. All right, now, we go down. Okay, we increase it to 40 watts. Increase the mic gain here to 40 watts. There's about 40 there. All right, now we're gonna take the generator down to 300 hertz. This generator is a real pile of crap. There's 300. Okay. And now, increase.
increase again until it reads 40 watts, 300, okay. We're gonna adjust the two trimmers now for 10 watts. So there's our 10 watts right there because I've already done this, but I'm doing it again for you folks. Okay. So this, these trimmers here, one of them in normal mode will affect it. So hit one of these for 10 watts. Might be this one, I don't know. No, nope, it's the other one. This one here. Uh, hit that one for 10 watts. Damn it. Okay. All right, there's 10 on the nose. Now we go to opposite. Ooh, I was on opposite. Okay, go to normal. And hit the other one for 10 watts. There, now let's see if they both agree. Just flop back and forth between normal and opposite and see what you get. Looks good. And that's it, you're all done. Turn it off and enjoy your radio. All right, thanks for riding along. I think we're all set, let's see. Anything else we gotta do here? Um, 10 watts, adjust bias control for max bias. Okay, we did all that. Okay, what else we gonna do here? Carrier frequency, we did that. Yeah, okay, so we've just done this. And it's all set. How about over here? Uh, it says, nope, that's it, it's all done. It's all done. Recheck audio generator at 15 and 40 watts. Okay, let's do that. Recheck it at 15 and 40 watts. There's 15. Okay. Do we got 40 watts still? We got a lot more than 40 watts. It kind of settles down to 40, but it's a lot better than it was. So what does that mean? Recheck the audio. Sweep down. 300 to readjust the carrier oscillator capacitors. All right, I think we're we're all set here. If I go back down to 300 again, I gotta handle this generator very carefully because the cheap Chinese plastic plug in the back will disconnect and make the generator reboot. It drives me insane, but that's my generator. All right, now we're back on 1500. Let's key it. Should be 40 watts or so. It's lower. So what does that mean then? It's lower than it was. Did I fiddle with the mic gain? Does that mean I want to go back and do it over, I suppose? So we go to 40 watts. Mic gain to 40. Okay, now the mic gain's on 40. We're at 40 watts again. 
I guess it makes sense to do it over. Now we're back, gonna go back to 300 hertz. Generator from hell here. Back to 300. Whoa, I don't think I was on 1200. Or 15. Okay, there's 1500. Let's do it over. Sorry about that. Transmit. Yeah, it wasn't 1500, so it might gain down. Go to 40 watts. There's 40 watts. We're just repeating it. All right, might turn it off. Go down to 300. And recheck it. 300. And recheck it. Should it be 10 watts, 10 watts, either side. Pretty much 10 watts. Other side, 10 watts, 10 watts, we're done. All right. So thanks for watching. Yeah, this these finals tend to go up high and then cool off. So either the power supply is being a little funky on me or the finals are soft, I don't know which. Anyway, that completes the uh, tune-up of this thing. I guess I could do PA neutralization too. I just wonder, yeah, I guess this is working fine now. All right, I'm gonna put the radio upright and give it a try. Thanks for watching, have a great day.